own state. Joining me now is Michelle De La Croce, the Arizona resident and founder of Mothers Against Illegal Aliens. Um, well, thanks for having me. Good to have you. Thank you so much. Good seeing you in the park. Welcome to Phoenix, Arizona. What do you make of that? That it's a big issue here. I know it's a big issue in Chicago where you've got this campaign it's going. It's a huge issue. Not nationally, it seems. Well, mean? it is nationally because I know that the members that keep writing to me are telling me that it's happening in Georgia and North Carolina, all the way to Florida, to California, Hawaii, and Canada. We're, we're, our issue here specifically has to deal with immigration. McCain, running for presidency, that's his, his, his platform, is going to be the most dangerous thing for our country. Because well, what is it you don't like about himself. his position? Well, his position is amnesty. He's isolated himself into a position right now with the, the Kennedy-McCain bill that um, now he's going out representing people who are running on strong immigration, strong borders like Graf here at the border. And it takes me aback because I'm just really wondering if he's just a wolf in sheep's clothing. So you say he's sending mixed signals. Oh, absolutely. he's done it to me, absolutely. What do you I, mean he's done it to you? What is he saying? Well, I've gone to uh, town hall meetings over in Prescott, Arizona, where I've specifically hit him hard on lines like anchor babies, um, molestations, rapes, and, and killings of and our border soldiers. He point blank said, I'm not going to dignify that with an answer. And to me, that's unacceptable. No one who's running for president should not dignify his answers to his constituents or the people of the United States. Our country is we the people of the United States, not we the business owners and corporations, because the foundation and the sovereignty to the republic is what someone who runs for presidency should sustain. President, I mean, Senator McCain, um, he, he's isolated himself. The majority of the people in Arizona are writing to him, calling to him. He's ignoring our pleas to secure our border. I mean, we have a governor, we have a, a senator, well, we've got senators around our country. Well, he there's a middle road on this. There's the no middle, middle road, road is you can't send back the 12 or 18 million Absolutely people you can. And, and the first you thing send is... send back 18 million people? Slowly, if you enforce yeah. and you don't have sanctuary orders and you start letting your police do their job because we have policemen whose hands are being tied right now, the reality is Senator McCain thinks this is a benign issue. So is this a drop-dead issue for you, Michelle? In other words, whoever the nominee is of the Republican Party, I assume you're Republican, but mm -hmm. whoever that nominee is, that if he or she isn't really tough on illegal immigration, they're not going to get your vote. They will not get my vote, and they will not get the votes of the majority of the people in the United States. I truly believe that wholeheartedly. So if they lose the House and or Senate today, is ignoring this issue the reason? Yes, sir, I think it is. All right, Michelle, thank you. Very thank good you seeing you. Thank you. Well,